Yo, what's going on? It's like uh, almost two in the morning. I need to leave my house at half past four in the morning for my flight, which is at nine in the morning. I leave it too late as always, so I'm gonna get like two hours sleep. Fun times, got all my camera shit in there, all my, uh, some repair stuff. I've got my soldering station in here underneath the towel. Um, yeah, camera stands, got some RTA mics in there, some speakers, got some headphones, DD headphones. I think I'm about ready. I think I'm about ready. All right, cool. So we're already in the airport and uh, that's the quickest check-in that I've ever seen in my life. It was, got here at the airport at six and I'm through security, checked in, everything all done. And it's now 6.15, so pretty sweet. I have loads of time for breakfast and uh, flipping drinks, maybe get a pint. Just trying to find somewhere for breakfast. There's like some really posh places, but I just want a cheap like pub or something. Uh, everywhere's freaking posh, so this will have to do. Oh, oh. It's got to be done. Got to be done. So as it turns out, I got put in the econ the economy space seats, which are like upgraded seats. They're more expensive, but because I didn't choose a seat, I got it free. Pretty nice. I actually have so much leg room, honestly. Like, I know it doesn't massively look like it with, with this bag in the way that I've got, but yeah, so much room. <laughs> very, very nearly there now by the looks of it. Just coming into land, it's a little bit bumpy on the way down through some clouds. 
and then that's the quickest leg of the journey out of the way now I've got to do the long leg from Abu Dhabi to Australia Get the crew, seats wide over please Through uh, customs, declaration stuff, got some MOSFETs, but they don't care about bringing FETs into Australia, so that's alright. Just waiting for my ride, Brad, and then we'll hit up his crib and see what we've got going on. Alright, let's see, it should be somewhere around here. Oh, look, it's raining cats and dogs. I have brought the British weather with me by the looks of it. Here it is, man! Main man, right here. So uh, yeah, just, just for a nice ride, I have to say, we're just going on the uh, highway here. It's, I've definitely brought the weather with me by the looks of things. And uh, yeah, I, got, I got a bit of a surprise, because for some weird reason, I, I'm terrible with geography and like different places and what actually goes on there. So I just assumed that the UK and Japan were the only weird people in the world that still drove on the left. But as I have just discovered, um, so does Australia. So plus one in my boots. Much history, that I was like, oh, that's okay. <laughs> it's like, yeah. So they they did they made this purely for it being awesome. So yeah. So like, if you look on the map, it's just like wings and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Je suis arrivé. Right, yeah, so first day in Australia. Uh, first impressions, it's hot, it's humid, it's very sticky. Um, the, uh, the place that I'm staying, Brad's place, is lovely. It's a wicked little place. Um, loads of space outside, got some uh, workshops here. I'll show you the workshop I'm going to do in Africa shortly. Uh, where did he say the place were? Um, yeah, the Australian hospitality is awesome. Um, going by these guys, uh, pretty much, they obviously work a day job. So uh, for, the, for the daytime, I'm pretty much here. And he, he said, uh, yeah, treat it as, as my own place, you know, eat what I like, I can uh, listen to music, do some work on the PC, um, chill out. So today, my first day, I'm going to be just sort of getting used to uh, where everything is and um, yeah, just having a sort of chill and catching up with my sleep. Uh, the jet lag is not too bad actually. I, I did I did it the right way around. What I did is I didn't actually sleep at all um, the night of really, I got like two hours sleep the night, the night of my flight. Um, and that was the right way of doing it. Uh, I didn't really sleep much on the plane either. I can't really sleep on the plane. It's just hella uncomfortable. Um, so I was pretty much just running on like adrenaline or just like running on just like the momentum of being awake and like the, the whole daytime is massively screwed up because like my body doesn't know whether it's light or dark when you're on the plane like it's light outside when it's meant to be nighttime for me and whatever so uh, that was okay so luckily I was able to keep rolling until literally by like 10, half 10, 11 this, uh, yesterday evening and so I slept through, got a really good night's sleep here actually so um, yeah the jet lag is, is pretty sweet, I'm not too bad so I'm going to take it easy today, uh, chill out a little bit uh, and I'll show you guys some of the audio stuff he's got laying around and the workshop where I'm going to be doing the amplifiers. 
yeah, just to kick the day off, I'm uh, cooking up a toasted sandwich because I'm not the world's greatest cook. I can cook some some stuff. Um, if, if I've looked at the recipe before, I know what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, breakfast, easy, toasty. If any of you have been subscribed to me for a long time, I actually made a video called just called Toasty. And it was to the uh, backdrop music of my bass and anthem instrumental. I just cooked up this kind of mad toasty. I had all kinds of stuff in it, like actually crisps in it and, and bits and pieces. So uh, yeah, really cool video. Yeah, the living room is a really nice area to chill out. There's like a ton of sofa space. You get like a whole bunch of people in here. Nice, decent TV, good size, like uh, pretty cool looking surround sound system, Sony job, media center PC, Xbox, PS3, etc, etc. And uh, yeah, there's some stuff in here. So uh, this is the room I've been put up in, it's a little bit of a mess as uh, I just came in here last night and crashed out, sleepy as hell, um, got some unpacking to do, a little bit of unpacking to do still, but most of it's all done. Got my uh, soldering station from the workshop, got my uh, thermal imager, a few MOSFETs, other bits and pieces, uh, yeah. So yeah, pretty much a nice chill day today. I've just installed a trial version of Sony Vegas on his Media Center PC so I can start editing some of these videos of my travels. I'm going to upload the videos in sections, so I'll do my travel video first, um, just getting here, and then I'll do some walk around videos. And then I will do the amplifier videos separately, so if anyone wants details on the repairs of those specific amplifiers, they haven't got to wade through me sitting on a plane and eating a bunch of food and stuff. It's, uh, it's a little bit more cloudy today, there's not a whole bunch of sun, so that's actually quite handy. I can chill in here and do some uh, video editing, uh, and then if the sun comes out a bit later, I might go out in the pool. Um, and then probably tomorrow, I will start work on the amplifiers and get some really good footage, because we've got quite a lot of amps to go through. We've got four Sundown 7500Ds, there's three Zenon 8Ks, uh, and there is a great big old school um, Class D, I think, I think it's like a 3K. It's like an old Australian brand, really rare thing massive great big heat sink um, and he's got some other bits as well that would be really cool to show you guys on video so this is going to be a wicked wicked little series of videos hit the subscribe button hit the bell icon to be notified when i do a new upload i will try and do a new upload once every couple of days here um, the uh, amp repair videos will obviously take longer to edit because i've got to repair them and then the repair process will take longer depending on how i get on with the trial version of sony vegas on his media sense pc whether it's uh you know fast enough to actually edit this stuff properly probably will be bearing in mind i'm still editing on an lga 775 uh with like ddr2 ram and a 560 ti so i'm sure he's his up-to-date i3 uh, media center PC will be more than enough. <laughs> so stay tuned and I'll catch you in the next vid.